Okay, I'd like to welcome everybody. Uh, we want to do an introductory to our fitness kickboxing program for you. We've uh, kind of specially designed a, a circuit that uh, really maximizes, uh, you know, sort of the intensity levels and, and sort of fat burning type thing. The great thing about this is that there's bags on every other station so that you can really tailor make your own workout. If you really hit the bags hard, you're really gonna intensify it. Uh, again, if you're just at, not quite at that fitness level, we're just gonna lightly tap the bags. It's still working our muscles and we're getting some practical use of our punching technique. So the only equipment that we really need for a program like this is just these fingerless gloves. That way we're able to grab all the equipment, skipping ropes and stuff like that. And it's not gonna interfere with the time because again, we try to keep the timer going and uh, keep the uh, intensity level up the whole time. The great thing about this program is that we can have different levels of intensity. So I got Dan here and Carrie are helping me and we'll try to do the different exercises and show you how we can modify it to, uh, again, depending on your fitness level. So we'll start off with some squats with the uh, kettlebells. All right, so basically, you know, with this one we can start off, again, if we just want to work the legs, we can hold it here, just kind of squat down, bringing it up like that. You can modify that a bit by working the arms and the legs. I'm gonna bring it all the way up and down like that. That way I'm getting the whole body working. And again, you know, we can get carry even if you don't wanna add the legs. You can just do the arms and legs separately, so that'll make it easier. And then Dan's gonna do them where he's also jumping type thing, so. Putting the intensity level up. We can do a kettlebell halo all the way around the head. So next ones we're going to do are lunges. Okay, we're gonna work the arms here. Bring them back, bring it up and back. Good full body workout. Okay, the bag work we do, we're just gonna start off with some basic jabs, sliding forward with our front hand, weaker hand, throwing jabs into the bags. Now again, some ways to get some more power. See how we're moving forward. You want to get the weight of your body as you throw that jab. And again, we can do it depending on our fitness level. You can do it really light. Just pop up and hit it just as we're going. Or you can really try to step forward and move it. Just like that. Get the weight of the bag coming right behind you. Good. Now our reverse punch. We're going to get more power because we can rotate our body. So we'll throw our strong punch. Reverse punch right into the bag. Throw some hooks. So you want to try to rotate the body. Come in, hitting low, just like that. So we can try jab, reverse, hook, hook, just like that. And again, if somebody's coming, uh, coming up to you, you know, you're able to protect yourself and it's a real sneaky attack. Come around and you get the power from your whole body on that strike too. So try a few of those. We're punching. We can try to add some elbows sometimes. We can grab the bag, do some knees. And again, okay, basic kicking technique. We start off with a basic front kick using either my front or back leg. I always want to make sure whatever my plant foot is is just turned out on a slight angle. I want to lift my knee up, kick and push and step back like that. So that's kicking with the back leg. I can do the same kick with the front leg. Make sure I have my weight on my back. Throw the kick out like that. Basic roundhouse kick. We want to turn the leg, bring the knee up, fire the bag, fire into the bag like that. So the whole body rotates, come around. There's the kick. I can do that kick with my front leg or with the back leg like that. Good. And just one more kick we do, just more for limbering up. 
is like a crescent kick. We're gonna go outside in. I can do that over the bag. And even if I'm not using the bag, it's just a good way to warm up the, uh, warm up the legs. If I was actually doing it on the bag when I got to there, I would actually come down and try to kick sort of an ax kick, punches, back leg kicks. Just keep trying to do all the different combinations with all the kicks that we learned. Bob's a great training aid because you can actually get used to actually aiming your punches. If you're hitting somebody, you might want to hit them on the nose or right on the chin. You know, go for the solar plexus to knock the wind out of them. Brutalize the ribs with some body punches. So Bob makes it a little more realistic. Another thing we do with Bob too, if you look for self-defense, you know, you didn't even think about a serious self-defense situation where you might throw a punch and then try to grab and scratch out the eyes or something like that. So it's a really good uh, tool for that. Also for the knees, you know, trying to knee either to the body, pull right down, try to knee to the head and stuff like that as well. So Bob takes a lick and keeps on ticking. All right, nice thing about this workout too is we can, uh, you know, work different muscle groups as we go along. Um, so we're just gonna demonstrate uh, three elastic exercises uh, for the arms. All right, I'm just gonna do basic arm curls. Together or individual, we have three different levels with the ropes too. The green ones are easy, the red ones are intermediate. Some leg exercises with these elastics too. All right, some ab exercises we do. Got our basic core bridge, holding on to it. You can also change it to like a, a Superman, working both sides. Or again, just right in the core bridge. Carrie's got some leg raises going on over here. Pointing the back. All right, some basic push-ups. Always good just to use your body weight. Working out, we've got some different variations. Push-ups from the knees still work as well. Bring in your favorite workout as well. And uh, I'm gonna just keep the, keep the circuit moving, keep the heart pumping the whole time. Okay. Skipping's a great warm-up and exercise, got some variations. Just keep the blood pumping, keep the body moving, keep jumping if you miss it. If you're not able to skip, you can just do what Dan's doing, simulate the movement. Okay, so that's a brief overview of our fitness kickboxing program in the over 20 years that I've been running my martial arts school. It's fun and exciting. It's the workout that I do every day. Uh, the nice thing about it too is you're working out, you get your fat burning, you get your muscle toning, but you're learning valuable skills that can also help you in a self-defense situation. As you come in, the workout varies every time. It's never gonna be boring. So it's just up to you now. Just start coming in, working out regularly two, three times a week is really what we advise and just start seeing all the benefits.